right, y'all, welcome back to the channel. It's Cody, the Astro Adventurer, and I'm gonna show you now how to install the AM5 mount onto the um, ZWO uh, AM5 carbon fiber tripod. So bear with me here. I've got the, uh, uh, the instructions right here, so hopefully we can figure it out. But I think it starts out by, you have to take this off here, there's an unlock thing here. Do you, so you turn this to the unlock? Yeah, there we go. Unlock area. And this should come out of here. And here it goes. Unscrew this out of here. And it might come out at some point. There we go. And then I think this goes on the bottom here. Yes, but it's this part that goes on there, so we'll take this out of here. All right, so this right here goes on, attaches to the bottom here with this part facing out. So, gotta unscrew these. They brought, they, you know, they gave us hardware and stuff, so. But these are just thumb tight right now. Hold the stub on. Tighter, obviously, when it's about the whole thing. All right, yeah, it says put the mount head on the tripod. Okay, use a hex wrench and three M6 screws to fix the head plate. No, oh, okay, so it's pretty easy here. So we just line these up with what I assume is the bigger holes. Yes, there we go. And let's use the hex key they gave us. Right here, yep, that'll be it. So let's get these on here. Just making sure we got everything lined up correctly. This one should be easy now. Let's make sure we get these pretty tight, I would say. That one's really loose still. Just check these to make sure they're all good. I have a problem trying not to break these sometimes as well. Get a little overzealous, so I would say don't over tighten it, right? There we go. Fine. And then I think we are going to install it on the tripod now. I think, yeah, I think this is how we go. Then we take this, put it back on here. Ah, oh, my gosh, that's nice in there. Eh, I don't know if that matters. Yeah, because we can rotate this at any time. Um, I'll probably just put mine like that. For now, I want it to be nice and lined up, but we can always uh, adjust that later because this thing is easy to, to uh, adjust. All right, so let's tighten that. Put this on here. And then take this and tighten it up. What if I happen to put this on? Oh, here we go. There we go. There we go. Now it's on there good. Just hadn't put it up there far enough. Okay. So I think make sure yeah yeah we put everything on there uh the correct way looks like to me so that is um essentially it so then we take the hand controller and we hook it up 
really don't envision using this very much to be honest, but yeah, you never know, right? So, so come on here. There we go. Helps if you put it the right way too, right? And then we can put it on here, put the hand controller in. Eh, yeah, whatever. We've got it in case we need it. And then, yeah, that's essentially, yeah, these, um, on the tripod, these unscrew right here and adjust. And it also came with, if you're putting it in grass, it came with these like little spikes that you can stick it down in the ground and, and make it more stable. So that's pretty much all she wrote. You know, now we just take the, the telescope and put it on top of here, slide it right on there. And I'll put my ASI Air on there as well, ASI Air Plus, and we'll be good to go. So. Hey, appreciate you joining me again, and thank you for watching, and uh, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and take care. Thanks a lot.